And how are you? Look absolutely beautiful. So do you, Felicia. I think we're really dressed up very nicely for this event, huh? I mean, it is the 50th. Hello. We had to do it big. How excited are you to be here tonight? Um, I'm excited. I'm honored to be nominated. Um, anytime, you know, you get recognition for your work. Uh, so, and I love being Fennec Shan. So there's nothing, nothing bad about tonight. Exactly. What do you remember? And congratulations uh, when you got the news that you were nominated. Um, I was very surprised only because, um, you know, the Book of Boba Fett, it's a limited series and uh, there was, there's been so much content out in this genre and the fact that um, this character who she was supposed to be dead in season one of The Mandalorian and then to come back and now to have this recognition, you know, I mean, it's just icing on a beautiful geek cake. I know what I, what I was saying. Like I love it. It's like a whole little nerd community here, and like we don't have to hide we're nerds. You can just be like nerds out loud. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I, you know, this is this is sort of like uh, our Oscars. I I really appreciate the you know the the effort that's put into celebrating the genre, and uh, I'm amongst my people. Yeah. <laughs> Let's take a minute to talk about fans and fans' response to your character. Were you surprised like how be beloved you became? Um, it's really wonderful only because um, I'm a huge Star Wars fan myself and I know that the Star Wars fandom out there, they are opinionated, they are, and rightly so, you know, they, when you love something, when you're so passionate about something, uh, you give it your all and um, I'm just very, very grateful that they completely embraced Fennec Shand, and I love seeing all the cosplays. I can't wait for this Halloween to really like see all the little, the little Fennec Shands running around this year. Do you have a Halloween costume? I, uh, I do, I do. Yes. Well, maybe I'll get Yell to 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 get it out of you inside from there. So I'm gonna toss it into you uh, inside. Britt Lauer, Severance. Aaron Morafe, The Boys. Elizabeth Olsen, WandaVision. <laughs> Beth Reescraft, Leverage Redemption. Kate Siegel, Midnight Mass. And Ming Na Wen, The Book of Boba Fett. And the award goes to. Oh gosh, if I can get it open. Ming Na Wen, Wen for the, the Book, Book of, of Boba Fett. Fett. Noah Wiley and I worked on ER together way back when, when we were kids, and this is really amazing and special. Um, such a surprise of, uh, you know, this is crazy because you guys saw that list of actresses, and um, uh, I'm Asian. I don't know if, if it's obvious, <laughs> but uh, I came to this country with my mom and my brother, and um, I didn't speak any English, and I never felt like I belonged. And for a long time, I felt this way. But what helped me was science fiction and fantasy. I would read Jerry Pornell, I would read Larry Niven, I would go see all these amazing you know, sci-fi shows and uh, comic books. We, we would go to these small conventions, me and my nerd friends, and I found a place where I belonged. And then when George Lucas came out with Star Wars, I found my religion. Sorry, Buddha. <laughs> and um, so this is such a symbol of acceptance and feeling like I belong. Um, I, I know that without people like John Favreau and Dave Filoni, Thank you so much for creating Fennec Shan for me. You have um, made this geek girl's dream come true like 
I, I can't even explain. And um, I really, I, I feel so good in this room only because we are all nerds. You don't have to be Asian. You don't have to be, it's just we love this genre. It gives us a, a feeling of belonging. And um, I want to thank my dream team, Ryan Bundra, Eric Kritzer, and Steve Muller um, for finding all these incredible opportunities when it's really difficult for an Asian, especially a woman of a certain age, to get work. They really helped make my other dreams come true. And my beautiful family, my non-geek husband, Eric, and my two kids, one geek, Cooper and uh, Michaela. Um, I celebrate this and um, thank you for this. Thank you, the Academy, for making me feel like I belong. Me. Um, and of course, I have to say it. May the force be with you, always. Mm -hmm.